Hey guys, Mooka here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to change textures on Borderlands 2 to anything you want. This is a pretty cool mod, you can just mess about with it, do whatever you want, so let's get straight into it. First off, you're going to need a file called TextMod. This is a program which allows you to get the textures from the game, and then obviously edit them. So just uh, launch that. Up here we'll have a browse button. And here is, as you can see, is the file location for my Borderlands 2. If you bought your Borderlands 2 from Steam, which is what I did, it'll be the exact same location. If not, you're just going to want to find .exe file for Borderlands 2 and open it. Then, as you can see, the little logo is there and everything. So first off, we're going to want to start in logging mode. Just have these settings as I have here. Just have them all ticked except alternative method. Put out the output format as PNG, log with whatever button you want. I'm using F11. And then output folder, just gonna wanna put that where you want. I'm gonna put mine here. I've created a folder on my desktop called Texture Dump. And hit run, and it should launch Borderlands 2. Okay, so now you can see we're on the main menu for Borderlands 2. And as you can see, the top left corner there is a bunch of red writing. So just hit continue, and it'll load you in the game. Alright, so now once we're loaded in the game, you're going to want to find a gun that you want to change the texture of, or anything in the game. And to do this, obviously, I'm going to change the texture of this rocket launcher here. Um, so first off, just want to go anywhere, and obviously, on your keyboard, at the numpad on the right hand side of your keyboard, which is where it is on mine, should be on yours as well. Hit the asterisk button, and that will lock the amount of textures loaded because as you can see in the red writing it says just over 3200 textures have been loaded so if we hit the asterisk it'll load every texture in the frame of like our screen so once you do that as you can see there's just over 100 textures so it's going to make it a lot easier to find the texture that we want to edit so now you use the plus and minus button to locate the texture and as you can see as I'm going through um, the texture that has been loaded will light up green so it's going to keep hitting plus until we farm, till the rocket launcher goes green. Uh, so let's just do that, I'm just going to quickly go through until we find it. As you can see there, the rocket launcher is green, so this is the texture of the rocket launcher which we're going to edit. So now you're going to want to hit F11 or whatever button you um, put to drop the texture. So once we've done that, just hit escape and quit Borderlands 2. Okay, so once you have quit Borderlands 2, you're going to want to open the file in which you uh, dropped the texture. And as you can see here, it, the texture is actually here. So you're going to want to open with Photoshop. So I'm going to do that now, and obviously it's going to ask for you to run it. So once the file is open in Photoshop, You can then edit it. So this is the texture of that rocket launcher. So first off, let's just start by making it pink. Because why not? Who doesn't want a pink rocket launcher? Um, so now we can do whatever we want on it. Um, let's give it some bright green polka dots. Do a polka dot and change the color to green. There we go. So now we can just duplicate this. And then let's create a separate folder. Put these green circles in the folder. And now we can duplicate both of the circles at once and move these and do the same we can now duplicate all four move them and we can now duplicate all eight move them just like that so now once you've finished editing the texture hit file and save then you're going to want to save it as a PNG and replace it. So now we've done that, we can close Photoshop. And now we're going to want to go back to text mod and go to package build. And you're going to want to find the location of the texture that you've created, which, 
which in my case is texture dump, and there will be a log file. I'm just going to want to open that and then hit build. And now we are going to want to again find that location. So texture dump for me, and then name it. So let's just do pink polka launcher, something like that, and hit save, and then go to package mode. And hit the browse button here, and at the side you can see Pink Polka Launcher, the one we've just created. Then hit run, and now the game should start again. And once it's started, we are going to pull out the rocket launcher, and the texture should change. So I will see you there. Okay, so now the game has started, so let's hit continue and see this rocket launcher that we've created. Okay, so let's wait for the lag to stop and pull out the rocket launcher and there you go it is let's go outside in the light it is bright pink as you can see with green polka dots all over it so yeah it's pretty cool you can make any gun look however the, uh, the hell you want you can even change the textures of the world don't know why you'd want to but you can so if you, this video helped you in any way shape or form make sure to smash that like button if you want to see more videos such as this, make sure to subscribe, it helps me out a lot. I will see you in the next video. I've been Mawika, peace.